George and I, well, we've known each other for quite some time. <laughs> we kind of go way back. As a very proud father, you do have snapshots in your mind that make you smile. And with Georgia, a definite image was when she was a toddler, about two, wandering around a pool with a dummy in her hand, wearing Debbie's shoes, along with some swimming armbands and her swimsuit. One strap, nonchalant, off the shoulder. Away she was going, holding court and making friends all around her. How things have changed, but not that much really. <laughs> Georgie, we could not be more proud of our daughter, of your achievements, your graduation, and you've always had a great choice of friends. And those friends will be very close to the family. And now your choice of husband. You've made us very proud and we love you very much. Stuart, your life is over. <laughs> oh, sorry, 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 sorry. Stuart, your life as a single man is over. You've been part of our family for a good while now, and to see you two together, I'm sure makes everyone here proud. It certainly does me. Today, you're surrounded by your loved ones, and all are wishing you well, as you create a brand new chapter in the story that is yours to tell. We'll talk about the memories you have yet to make together and the moments you've already shared to be carried with you forever. But take the time to live today as your marriage will begin. Look around and soak it up, this moment that we are in. For this is where the magic starts. When you both say your vows, you pledge to spend your lives as one because of the love you share now. So, yes, here's to a future that is bright and warm and clear. But more than that, here's to right now and what it means for us all to be here. Georgia, I give you this ring as a symbol of my eternal love. As this ring surrounds your finger, so my love surrounds you. And I, Stuart, accept you, Georgia, in marriage to be my lawfully wedded wife. I give you this ring as a token of my love, and I promise to love, honour and support you. Stuart and Georgia, on this great day, made a great choice in life. Be married for your family and friends. I can say with pride and privilege, following a declaration made in my presence, that you, Stuart, and you, Georgia, are now legally married. And you are, of course, husband and wife, ladies and gentlemen. It's my great pleasure to welcome you all here to celebrate the marriage of the new Mr and Mrs Dale. A big welcome to all the guests and friends. I've been told to tell you that you're here to enjoy yourselves, to eat, to drink, to dance and help us celebrate this great day. Ladies and gentlemen, family, friends and be upstanding, please join me in a toast to the happy couple. <laughs> George and Stuart.
Yes, sir.